Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your Wi-Fi or Ethernet-based internet connection is not working on your Windows XP computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we are going to start off by opening up the Start menu. And you want to select the Run button. And into this field, you want to go type in NCPA. Dot CPL, exactly how you see it on my screen. And then you want to select OK. Right click on your internet network type under here. It might say wireless as well. Go ahead and right click on it and select where it says repair. And give it a moment here. And hopefully now if you attempt to connect to your internet, hopefully that has resolved the problem. If you're still having an issue, attempt to reset your router settings as well. So if there's a router refresh button on the front of the router, I recommend holding it down for about 10 seconds and then releasing pressure on it or just unplug it from the wall and then plug it back in 30 seconds or so later and see if that helps resolve the problem. Something else I recommend doing while we're still logged into Windows XP here, open up the Start menu, select All Programs, Accessories, and then Command Prompt. Type in IP config space forward slash flush DNS. Flush DNS should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on the keyboard. Should come back a Windows IP configuration. Successfully flushed the DNS resolver cache. Now you want to type in NETSH space WINSOC, W I N S O C K, space reset. Again, exactly how you see it on my screen. Hit enter. Give it a moment here. Should come back with successfully reset the WENSOC catalog. You must restart the machine in order to complete the reset. Go ahead and close out of here and then restart your computer. There you go, guys. Hopefully that was able to help resolve your problem. And as always, thank you for watching. Do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.